first i would like to kick start this interview like uh, with an overview of this of what we are all about see uh, cohesive technologies uh, was incorporated a decade back and we guys are primarily into voice over ip products so any product what you see here either it is a paging system or a ip phones or a, a unified communication platform or a door phone or an access control or a surveillance everything is based on sip voip and every product talks to each other that's what the usp is all about like uh, what what was the initial idea behind starting this company like cohesive technology no we you know when we used to go abroad mm-hmm. and used to move around in the world we used to see that everything is on a one single network which is you know fiber or a ethernet right. and in india everything like for an example uh, camera was moving on an rf coaxial cables telephony was moving on a single pair copper ethernet and computers were working on a lan cable so this and the pollution are increasing the carbon footing is going so high yes so definitely we, see yeah. this is also a biggest threat to yeah so uh, we thought why not converge everything into one single infra and let's save on carbon footing let's save on the network let's save on the wiring and not only save uh, on the angle of what network is all about but also make this products talk to each other so as a user you get benefit of lot now since you are here at a convergence expo to expand your business may i know your expansion plan see <laughs> we guys are uh, growing not only for india but southeast asia like nepal maldives sri lanka uh, we are doing extremely good business in uh, nepal so nepal is one country where a lot of business of voice over ip is coming up sri lanka because of economy recent economy which has gone down it went down but now again it is coming up so because of this converge platform and the countries surrounding india our expansion plans are in good books so uh, so like uh, what opportunities do you foresee in india's manufacturing strength and the government initiatives the initiatives taken or uh, taken by the government what opportunities do you currently foresee no in last two years we had seen because this atmanirbhar movement which narendra modi yes, ji our in india respected campaign. prime minister has started a lot of people in form of sdks or completely knocked down kits at least yes. because india is still lacking behind on the vlsi and semiconductors productions so in a completely knocked down kit people have started assembling it doing started working on the stacks which gets uploaded on the platforms so i'm i in 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 around 4 5 years down to the line i think all these products will get manufactured here so how has been your uh, overall experience so far at convergence and yeah, getting good response yeah day one is like uh, decent and that too in the first half we uh, the response was good extremely good oh, perfect thank you so much sir for your time looking forward to grow with a growing nation and i hope you are contributing to india's go to like uh, made in india campaign also i uh, will definitely trying for it and i hope that our economy as well as the product lines outshines the people around it's yes, definitely